Hey guys, hope you are doing good and welcome to a new video. In this video, I wanted to provide simple definitions for AI and ML. As you might already know, AI stands for artificial intelligence and ML stands for machine learning. Artificial intelligence describes a computer's ability to make decisions like human beings. An example would be a computer that can play a game of chess. So when people say artificial intelligence, where does this intelligence exist? Or what is the source of this intelligence? This question can be answered with much more clarity when applied to natural intelligence. When we compare two people at the opposite end of the IQ spectrum, you can easily say that one of them is more intelligent and that the source of their intelligence is their well-developed brain. However, computers have fixed specifications. You could have a computer with 16 processors and 100 plus GB of RAM. It doesn't mean that it can drive your car. If you are like most 20-year-olds, you will use this computer to just play games. However, the same computer can be used by a company like Google to drive 10 cars. So, where is the source of intelligence? In one word, software. An AI system includes the software and other components that the software needs to function like a human being. In order to drive a car, a computer needs the ability to see. So, the camera, the software and any other sensors from which the software pulls or pushes data can be considered to be a part of an AI system. On this slide, we have a simple block diagram that represents how a self-driving car is controlled. So in conclusion, artificial intelligence is intelligence that has been created artificially by humans. Now, one could say that human beings are a form of artificial intelligence that were created by a superior form of living being, right? Okay, so I hope you get some clarity on artificial intelligence. now. What is machine learning? I think we have a very good answer for this since we have already established a connection between natural and artificial intelligence. Let us think about how our human brains develop intelligence. Then we could apply the same concept to describe how a machine develops the ability to learn. If you want to learn to play the guitar, you would undoubtedly suck at it on day one. Each day you practice or train you use your ears to get feedback on the way you play and you make slight adjustments to the way you pluck or strum the strings. Eventually, you get better at it. Your fingers become more strong and agile. Your ability to map a sound with the right fret improves. The entire process of training, getting feedback and training back again is what gives human beings the intelligence to play guitar. It would have to first train itself, by which I mean that the software program has to have the ability to listen to music and reproduce it on a guitar while correcting itself from time to time. You need an AI system which can listen to and play guitar. That is what machine learning is all about. Machine learning is the process by which a machine acquires artificial intelligence. When machine learning takes place, there is a piece of software in that machine which tries to help the machine learn whatever it is that it's trying to learn. All right. I hope you guys found this video useful and I'll see you guys in the next class. Bye.